Now to a developing story out of North Harris County. Four kids found abandoned inside a home. Harris County deputies say the children were found at a home on Cypress Hill Drive and Cypress Spring Drive. And that's where we find KPRC 2's Brittany Jeffers. And Brittany, you spoke with the man who found the kids in deplorable living conditions. Mm -hmm. Well, not only did this man find the children, he also called 911. He said he and his girlfriend had just left the store. They were out here in this area when they found three of those four children standing here in the middle of the street all alone. We see two kids naked and it's cold outside at that. And they just running around onto the street and we're like, whoa, whoa, whoa. He wanted to conceal his identity, but Johnny says around 10 o'clock last night, he was shocked to see three children in the front of this home in the middle of the street with no adult in sight. Hey, we got to see where their parents said. So we go knock on the door. Nobody's going in there. We look inside. It's a it's a mess. Diapers were soiled like they haven't been changed in days. The interior of the home was in an awful state of disarray, uh, untidiness. It was very unkept. Uh, refrigerator, refrigerator doors open. One of the children, the toddler, was inside the home, had fallen from the crib, was on the floor. And so, really, a, an awful set of circumstances. Sheriff Ed Gonzalez says four children, two boys and two girls, all under the age of four, had been abandoned, left to fend for themselves for at least two days. Our team uh, beca became uh, increasingly concerned because, sadly, one of the the uh, the children said that he thought his mommy was dead. Uh, so that was uh, something very chilling. Later on, Sheriff Gonzalez says the children's parents were located at a motel on Highway 6 and 2. The mother, Angel Huff, now facing three counts of child endangerment. Their father, Markel Dorsey, a felony violation of bond conditions. Court documents show that Dorsey has a criminal history, most recently charged with assaulting the children's mother at a motel on January 1st. So the big question on everyone's mind is how are these children doing? I asked the sheriff and he says that they are okay, they are safe, they're with a family member right now. We also reached out to CPS which released this statement saying Child Protective Services is investigating this case alongside law enforcement to ensure the well-being of the children. We're grateful the children were found unharmed and that they're now safe with other family members. For now we're live in spring. I'm Brittany Jeffers, KPRC 2 News. All right, thank you for that update.